Kentucky, the most accurate in Central Kentucky. How deep is the snow in the Northeast? Well, it is so deep, it is possible to be seen from outer space. Look at this. This is a picture of the New England area taken from a satellite. It normally would not look like that, but because <laughs> of all of that snow, in some places, record amounts of snow, it is clearly visible from outer space. Yeah, you'd almost think that was cloud cover, but actually snow. Hard How to about that? Fortunately, we're not dealing with any snow here, but much of the country, Kentucky included, dealing with very cold temperatures. That's right. Now, parts of the Commonwealth could actually see a little snow as we head into tomorrow, even though we're not expecting much. And that's exactly right. The big weather story really is the bitterly cold temperatures. It's a cold night here on the Fort Banks Skyview from EKU's campus. We see a little cloud cover off toward the west right now. Of course, no snow anywhere close to us at this time. No snow flurries to speak of as well, with temperatures anywhere from the upper teens in Lexington to Flemingsburg. Many locations right now, though, in the 20s. It's 20 degrees in Mount Sterling to 24 in Irvine, 21 right now in Jackson to upper 20s, even lower 30s out toward Pineville and Harlan right around the freezing mark. Tomorrow morning, we actually start off in lower teens with wind chills in the single digits. It's going to be a light breeze this evening and overnight. But you'll need those extra layers on the hat, the coat, the gloves, just kind of like what you needed earlier this morning. As we look at the bigger picture, we do have a cold front again off toward our northwest. That will move into the area by tomorrow evening, and that's what could provide a couple light snow showers for far northern Kentucky. We wake up 7 a.m. tomorrow morning with actually a little sunshine, but the clouds will be on the increase here from 12 noon to 5 o'clock. By the late afternoon hours, cloudy skies, seeing snow developing out across southern Indiana here at 5 o'clock, and by late afternoon, into the evening hours. This is where we could see some light snow showers just kind of moving right across the northern fringe of the viewing area. Really, the better chance for snow will stay to the north of the Ohio River, but could have just enough that you could have just a minor accumulation. And of course, it will be below freezing, well below freezing. So anything that does fall could create a couple of slick spots, but most of us will miss out on the snow. And as we go into Saturday, we'll just stay with mostly cloudy skies to start off your New Year's weekend. For tonight, 12 degrees. Clouds will be on the increase at times as we continue this evening, and we'll see a little clearing by around daybreak on Friday. Friday afternoon, then the clouds will increase once again. Highs around 30 degrees, so we stay just below the freezing mark as we head into the afternoon hours. Again, we could see some light snow for far northern Kentucky. Looking at your New Year's Eve weekend, Saturday's high 31 degrees, and we'll see our temperatures even cooling more for New Year's Eve Sunday, 22 degrees, a frigid day overnight, low temperatures actually in the single digits by New Year's morning, and then New Year's Day, a high of only 17 degrees as we start off 2018. Looking at the bigger picture here with your seven day forecast, again, 30 degrees, could see some light snow further to the north for your solid blue forecast. Again, we've got a lot going on. We've got the UK versus Louisville basketball game at 1 o'clock, and you can also catch the UK football game Music City Bowl happening here locally at 4.30 and in Nashville at 3.30. Saturday, 31 degrees, lower 20s for high Sunday. Monday, a high of only 17 degrees for your New Year's Day. And you can see for the most part we stay dry into the early part of next week. Could see another chance for some light snow by next Thursday. But overall, it's just a big story, the bitter cold. Oh, no question about it. The big story tomorrow, solid blue sports. Basketball against Louisville. Music City Bowl against Northwestern. We'll preview it all next.